Hello everyone, my name is Ilen, your host on this show, Mamlaka Kids Club. So last week we had a lot of fun, we danced, we sang, we had, um, I read for you a very good story with a very nice moral. And also I gave you a riddle, the riddle was, I have a head and a tail but no body, what am I? And to those who commented your answers, I appreciate it. The answer was a coin, did you get it right? If you did then, well, congratulations. And um, also, if you want to interact with us, you can find us on our social media platforms at Mamlaka Television Media, TikTok at Mamlaka Television Media, YouTube at Mamlaka Television Media, Facebook, and or 07 00 Before we continue, let us listen to this one song, Hakuna Matata. back so the song hakuna matata so it came from the lion king and timon and pumba were encouraging simba not to worry that everything will be fine and also i have a riddle for you the riddle is i can go up and down but i cannot move what am i i'd like you to sms your answers to 0700899899 and as we continue let us listen to this other song we are one from the lion king it's like saying you don't want to be a lion. It's in your blood, as I am. We are part of each other. Hmm. As you go through life, you'll see there is so much that we don't understand 
And the only thing we know is things don't always go the way we planned. But you'll see every day that we'll never turn away when it seems all your dreams come undone. We will stand by your side, filled with hope and filled with pride. We are more than we are, we are one. I'm back guys with a quote for you. The quote is every I can achieve starts with I believe. If you want to achieve achieve something, first of all you must believe in yourself. You must believe that you can do it and you'll achieve it. As the Philippians 4:13 says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. You should also know that you can need like your strength has to come from God for you to achieve. I'll be back after a short break with Dancy.
So what I believe you were trying to say is thank you. Thank you? You're welcome. What? No, no, no. I, I didn't. I wasn't. Why would I ever say <laughs> okay, that? I, okay. mean... <laughs> I see what's happening, yeah. You're face to face with greatness, and it's strange. You don't even know how you feel. It's adorable. Well, it's nice to see that humans never change. Open your eyes, let's begin. What? Yes, it's really me, it's Maui, breathe it in. I know it's a lot, the hair, the bod. When you're staring at a demigod, what can I say except you're welcome for the tides, the sun, the sky. Hey, it's okay, it's okay, you're welcome. I'm just an ordinary demi-guy. Hey, what has two thumbs and pulled up the sky? When you were waddling, yay, hi, this guy. When the nights got cold, who stole you fire from down below? You're <laughs> looking at him, yo. Oh, also I lasso the sun. You're welcome to stretch your days and bring you fun. Also, I harness the breeze. You're welcome to fill your sails and shake your trees. So what can I say except you're welcome for the islands I pull from the sea. There's no need to pray, it's okay. You're welcome. Ha. I guess it's just my way of being me. You're welcome. You're welcome. Well, come to think of it, kid, Honestly, I could go on and on. I could explain every natural phenomenon. The tide, the grass, the ground. Oh, that was Maui just messing around. I killed an eel. I buried its guts. Sprouted a tree. Now you got coconuts. What's the lesson? What is the takeaway? Don't mess with Maui when he's on a breakaway. And the tapestry here in my skin is a map of the victories I win. Look where I've been. I make everything happen. Look at that. Me, mini Maui. Hey! Well, anyway, let me say you're welcome. Wonderful world, you know. Hey, it's okay, it's okay. You're welcome. welcome. Well, come to think of it, I gotta go. Hey, hey it's your day hey, to say hey, you're, welcome. you're welcome. Cause I'm gonna need that boat. I'm sailing away, away. You're welcome. Cause now we can do everything but float. Thank you. Hi. I'm back as I said with the guest who will be teaching me the dance. She's a dancer. And would you please introduce yourself? My name is Clara. I'm from a crew called Ground Shaker and I'm a dancer. And what is the name of the dance you'll be teaching us? The name of the dance. Okay, that's me. <laughs> I'm in the world, 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 I'
Wow, that was amazing. I hope you learned the dance. You can teach someone around you. And anyways, I'll be right back after a short break with story time. I'm back with the story, guys. Listen carefully because I'll be asking questions at the end of it. So, a bamboo and a mango tree stood side by side. And the bamboo was envious of the mango tree because the mango tree produced fruits. And people loved the mango tree more than the bamboo. So one day a storm came and the mango tree was not strong and firm enough and it broke and fell down. While the bamboo st still stood there strong and firm. So the moral of the story is not to, like, to embrace your uniqueness and strength. Like the mango tree produced fruits while the bamboo tree stood there farm. So if you come to think of it, everyone is unique in their own way. Like the mango produced fruits, but the bamboo couldn't produce fruits. The bamboo stood firm, but the mango tree couldn't stand firm. So here comes the question. Question number one, who stood by the mango tree, a bamboo? tree or a avocado tree or a banana tree and also the second question is what came a tsunami a storm or thunder the last question which tree stood firm was it the mango tree was it the avocado tree was it the bamboo tree was it the banana tree i'd like you to sms your answers to 0700 899. I'll be right back after a short break with Arts and Craft. One, two, three. Use a paper crafts.
Um, that was an amazing arts and crafts session. I hope you learned what we made today. And also, I've been your host, Elaine, and I'll see you next time. Same place, same time. Bye! Thank you.